So you think you might have that next new idea for a groundbreaking application? Well, Cisco is announcing a worldwide application developer contest using the Cisco Integrated Services Router, that's the ISR, application extension platform, that's the AXP. This contest might be for you. Welcome to the special edition of Are You Smarter Than a Cisco Developer? <laughs> Just kidding. Well, about the title anyway. We are having a contest, and it's a great one. But first, speaking of code jockeys, please welcome our head geek, Jimmy Ray Purser. Hey, buddy. How are you doing, Rob? I am doing very well. So welcome. the first question is, what is this contest all about, man? Oh, man, this contest is awesome. It pits you or your team against the rest of the world using the power of the AXP to actually design an application to use our platform to build whatever you want, whatever your imagination sees fit out there. If you're looking at different source code that you have or different ideas to maybe make a phone work better, to take advantage of the resources we have on ISR, this contest is for you or your team. Well, this is interesting. You know, we've talked a lot about the AXP. We have a Tech Notes video podcast out on it. Please be sure oh, to check yeah. that out if you want to get some more information on that. How would you describe the AXP uh, in, in brief? Well, the XP is really my favorite product that we have, and it's a product that actually is an independent development platform that has a Linux kernel on it, if you will, but it's got all the processes isolated on it, so I'm not stealing processes or memory from a router mm. to actually run these applications, so I don't have memory runaway problems or burn through on an application or anything like that. Um, I can design and develop anything I want, C, Java, uh, Python, Perl, whatever. I can code my applications right on here and actually take advantage of all the APIs we have in a, in a Cisco router. So to fellow code jockeys out there, there's, there's quite a few languages to choose from. You're not limited. Uh -huh. Talk a little bit about the contest details mm -hmm. here. What are the specifics that we need to be aware of? Well, you know, I think I think some of the uh, the most important thing is we've got a couple versions here. We've got an internal vo version for folks like me and you to compete, so we can write our own applications on here. And then we've got an external version um, for all the folks out in the world to actually compete against each other to see who can come up with the best idea for these routers. So you're not really uh, competing against Cisco folks who may you know may think, well, this is not fair because they've got access to different data and stuff. I do you know, internal contest, external contest. All right. Now, well, from a structural perspective, the contest is going to take place in two phases. Is. First one is high level. You know, what is your idea? How innovative is it, etc.? Based on this evaluation, a set of five to ten proposals are going to be shortlisted as finalists. This will get you to that lucky second phase, and it's for those who are selected there get to strut their stuff and actually start coding some things. So, phase two submissions are going to result in just three ranked winners. Updated information on contest specifics can be found at cisco.com slash go slash think inside. Love that one. Look, here's the thing you don't have to have any money at all to enter this contest. You don't have to run out and buy an ISR and an XP module. We do have the VMware platform where you can actually virtualize the application, write it on your PC, Good on one. your Linux, on your Apple, whatever, um, and then you can actually submit that up to us or submit your proposal. So it doesn't cost you a penny to win thousands of bucks uh, and actually apply that to some cool stuff like all that Star Trek memorabilia that's on mm. sale right now. So yeah, this is a, a <laughs> great, great platform, a great contest to really show what you know.